And a very good Monday evening, uh, everybody. Hope you are uh, enjoying it, uh, enjoying the kind of active weather we've had out there. Just playing the radar loop here. Uh, we didn't even have some lightning out there earlier. Uh, not sure you could catch it there in the last few uh, few radar scans. But if we just pause this and go ahead, you can see it right there. In fact, uh, about 6 o'clock, we had some uh, lightning there south of Minot. Picked up a little lightning uh, near the center area in Washburn. And in fact, if I play this just a little longer, you can see that we had some lightning with a heavier core here uh, towards the Wilton area. So that was at 6 o'clock earlier. Uh, right now, we have some showers mostly pushing through Bismarck, but this is quietly... Uh, are starting to quiet down a lot. Things are going to calm down overnight tonight. Uh, still do have more active weather, however, and uh, we actually have a wind advisory out west. Uh, that's going to be for tomorrow late in the morning till tomorrow afternoon. Uh, you can see it off towards the west there. Uh, temperatures tonight, we're not looking at anything uh, too extreme. In fact, temperatures tonight are going to be pretty mild, uh, getting down to the mid to upper 20s for everybody. And your highs tomorrow, temperatures are getting up into the 30s and 40s. Now, that means that most of the precipitation will be in the form of rain, but uh, we'll see a little bit of light snow mixing in there as well. So let's go through your forecast here, three-day forecast for Dickinson, rain, snow, and very windy. We're going to be talking about more about that uh, coming up at 10 o'clock. Very windy out towards the west for Williston as well. And you can see it stays windy there on Wednesday and Thursday. So tomorrow, very warm, even warmer on Wednesday. And we'll be looking at a cold front kind of knock us back on Thursday. But you can see it warms right back up. It does look like some truer Arctic air arrives here in our area by late in the weekend, early next week. Still a ways down the road. Uh, but again, we'll be talking more about the big story coming up, which is going to be that wind. And we'll show you how strong we expect it. Uh, that coming up at 10 o'clock tonight. We'll see you then.